All right, we're here on Father Campbell's Chapel. We're playing the little guy. I can't keep a good guy down. That's the spirit, Chucky. We're playing the little guy. We're playing Chucky. Because we like the little guy. He's not just a good guy. He's a fun guy. <laughs> Let's try this on the quiet side. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Yeah. <laughs> that add on gives us a little bit. A little bit less of a... <laughs> Hello. Somebody tried to use a flashback? For what it's worth? <laughs> Hi. You're mine. All right. Hey, you have boil over, Kate. Hi, uh. I hate boil over. God, let's hope none of those little staggers are going to keep us from getting her to that hook. I don't know. It's going to be tight. Barely. Somebody up here? Hello. Come here. Yeah. <laughs> that window's gonna be blocked, huh, Fang? Yeah. I could have scampered. <laughs> Let's play the I'm actually using the... I was say, I'm using the stealth more than I'm using anything else there. You have yeah. boil over. Come oh on. my... Don't look so sad, Joe. Oh my god, Fang. I hate boil over. I don't think I'm getting her to this. That's too far. Well, I'm annoyed now. <laughs> yeah! That's a good play. Jumped into the locker. That was a very good play. Alright, Kate.
Hey there, Tap. I don't know about that. I thought I had that. Yeah. Mr. Tap, I thought I had you there, buddy. Gotcha, you dumb shit. Look, detective, those views are not mine. Yeah. All right, we took a chance. We need the scourge hook, to be honest. All right, she so does have a pallet here. I'm still gonna go kick this, cause I don't, yeah, this isn't the gen that got pain res. Hello. She doesn't have lies, she's simply... Yeah, run, dipshit. She's simply doing that. All right, this time, we are getting you to a hook, Fang Man. I'm killing the fang. I'm sorry. You didn't stand a chance. That gen's still regressing. I suppose we're tunneling the fang out the match. I will fucking kill you. <laughs> oh, come on, man. No pallet here, so. Yeah. How is that game? Yeah. Missing. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Not where I wanted to be, but we're gonna go here. Obsession is way over there. See, 20 seconds, we're never gonna get there in time. <laughs> hey, this is a gen with work on it, so we're gonna pop it. Pop it and see if we can That time we got him. Shaq Pallet is still up. He's still right. No. All right. Fucking time. I am pretty sure. I'm pretty sure we scurred took the tap, but this is closest anyway.
<laughs> All right, the ex obsession is running that way. If we can catch them. <laughs> yeah, see, that's the problem. There's not enough time for us to... Hello. Take this, dipshit. Well, that's gonna help. I think this might be the person we didn't scourge on. I also think the tap is going to be dead here in a moment. Tap is dead. The obsession lit a boon. They're going to be exposed? <laughs> God, they were here. There she is. Boil over, Kate. Uh, Kate, I hate boil over. Uh, uh, <laughs> Wee, <laughs> Chucky. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, that'll do it. We had our rift challenge done which was four iridescent emblems. We got our rift challenge done. Um, ironically, we, we somewhat tunneled the fang out of the match. Uh, I want to say, I, I don't know if she was the one or if it was the Kate who got away with us having to drop them because of boil over because we couldn't get them to, to the scourge hook we wanted to. Uh, in either case, the two boil over people, uh, the fang running tenacity to get away from, I guess from maybe hooks. Uh, the other Kate just had boil over, so no flip flop on either one of them and no one was running breakout. Uh, Detective Tap had distortion, so if he was ever the obsession, we were not gonna see him with our Friends to the End perk. Uh, Friends to the End gave us information and let us know where people were, but we were never able to get somebody down with it. Didn't matter. Uh, the person we got out of the match first was the Fang, but she didn't have the lowest point total. The last person we got out, of course, was the Kate. And again, Friends to the End helped us because we knew where she was hiding, at least the general vicinity. We could see which way she was moving. And even though we didn't see her right away, we were eventually able to figure out kind of where she had gone and kept her from getting a rescue. The Zarina uh, was the last person we hooked. We had hit her, but not hooked her. We had concentrated on everybody else, so she died on one hook. But uh, again, get us they got us down to one gen, but the Scourge hooks and pop was just enough. And what did we use our power for? Now we did land a really nice hit on the tap with our slice and dice. We didn't use it that often this match. We used it more, mainly more for just uh, getting around the map in a stealthy fashion to try to surprise the survivors. And there were numerous times, I think we did, that we were able to get up on survivors quickly. Uh, we were also running the add-on that uh, decrease. is this the terror radius? Yeah, whenever Heidi Ho modes and cooldown, our terror radius is reduced by four meters. That's not a lot but every little bit helps when you want to try to sneak up on somebody. 
And I think our stealth is what won it for us in this match. A 4K on Father Campbell's as the little guy, Chucky. Give him the finger there, Chuck.